Bans have been dished out to Smith, Warner and Bancroft for ball tempering. Most cricketers and pacers in the subcontinent would have been surprised by the harshness of the verdict. And I say that on the account that their careers have been forced to look up uncautious source like ball tempering to survive on dead pitches here. By and large, it's been an acceptable offence. Wrong, but true. In another part of the world, Australia assailed the cricketers with great energy, driving them out of the game. Character versus skill, winning at all cost versus integrity were at play in determining a verdict. It's a brave decision to lose two world-class players, but importantly, sets the tone for other boards that swift, timely decision on cheating the game and breaching the trust can quickly instill credibility in the system. You need clarity and strength to be dismissive of the talent who has crossed the line. The proverbial, no one is bigger than the game has been heard loud and clear.